What's up everybody, it's me Tristan back for another episode of Moose Bear. I am here with a friend, the Big James, and uh, we are at a little place called Indian Creek. Yesterday was the 4th of July, happy Independence Day. We went fishing on the Tennessee River. Didn't catch a whole lot, but had a good time. Caught a couple. What we're gonna do is we're gonna hike through Indian Creek, try to catch some fish. Well, nothing else more to say. Let's get started. Let's go. All right, here we go. Down the old creek. I feel like a hobbit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, this feels good. This water is cold, dude. I don't know how it's so cold. It's 100 degrees out today. Woo! Woo, buddy! It is ice. It is ice. Ooh. Ooh. It's got a big drop off right here. <laughs> Cast right here. Oh, oh, I had movement right there. Did you see that? I had movement. The funny thing is all the fish were probably right here in the deep end. Yeah. And we scared them all off. Something just swam right next to my leg. All right, guys. Haven't got a bite yet, so we are going to move downstream. I was checking out this place the other day and I saw some fish, so I don't know where they all went, but we're gonna go find them. Gotta be really careful because a bunch of sharp, slippery rocks. Woo, getting strong over here. And yeah, there's a big rock right there. Ugh. All right, guys, just saw a bunch of fish jumping around over here, so we're gonna. Hike around over this way. Crap. Yeah, where I come from. Let's go. Oh, got movement. Had movement right there. It's actually pretty smart. Let the current take it over there, James. Thank you. <laughs> oh, no way. There's a crawdad right here. I don't know if you guys can see him. Hey James, can you grab my pole for me, man? I'm gonna try to get this guy out. I think that's a crawdad. Yeah, that's definitely a crawdad. Fact, I'll tell you what. Let's do this. <laughs> We got all that work for a little freaking crawdad. That's so weird. Look, he's got like a, a little claw. Do they grow the back their claws? I don't know. Crawdad. May, we, oh crap. I think another one just got on my shoe. <laughs> may not catch fish. We got a little crawdad. How about that? Alright, don't let him go. Go back to your little. There was a fish right here, but can't hook onto him. The search continues. Got yeah, found this huge, big open water right here. It looks pretty steady, so if there's any fish, that's where they be. Fish. We got one. Oh, we had a bite, James. There's definitely fish all up in there. Yeah, they're in there. I saw them flop out of the water. He's just not hooking. Why are you not hooking? 
So they keep pulling our worms off, sliding them off, which is weird because we're using really small hooks. I guess they could have been smaller. Yeah, they're probably, we're probably using a little too big. Yeah, our hooks are a little too big, but yeah, look at, they got his worm though. So I have a smaller hook. So I think we might actually catch some fish if we do this bad boy, because this might actually hook them. So let's go. You got one, you got one, you got, oh. You got one, you got one, no way. Yeah, we got one baby. Yeah, boy. GoPro start recording. I, I record that whole time. Oh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, so, ow. We finally got on the board. Oh, we got a little smudgy smudge. We finally got on the board. Um, old boy James. When that old boy James took over, in the words of uh, Froggy Fred. Oh, I think he got another one. Do real man. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Look at him. The small hook the worked, baby. Hook the there we go. Little hook. Got the brim for days in the creek. That's his cousin. Boom. Got him. Throw him on back. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> he gone. He's gone. He gone. Okay, number that's two. Not one of my strong suits. We'll be done with <laughs> that's number two. Let's keep it going. We got one. Come on. Come on with it. Come on with it. That's a bigger one. No, that's still tiny. <laughs> it's pretty. Nuh uh. I, think. I mean, oh, there's maybe. nothing but. There it goes. Came off the. There it goes. Another one. <laughs> no way. Yeah, boy. Yeah, boy. Little brim all day long we got we got two we got two baby two at the same time let's go yeah boy what is that what is that hold on hold the phone what kind of fish is that sucker there's a, oh there he goes man these suckers just slide right out of your hands man it's a little fighter this guy's a little fighter man he's fighting come on with it come on with it ah, that's probably the biggest one <laughs> you think Maybe. That's the biggest brim so far. Yeah. Uh, maybe. I think we're tied now. Was it 3-3? Three, three? Yep. All right, guys. Comment at home. Who you think will win? The big T or the big James? There he is. Let's film him releasing underwater. How about that? Let's try that out for size, huh? Go back in the water. Just see if I could catch one actually standing in the water. Woo! Woo! Here we go. Back in the water. Back in the wild, I'm trying to catch fish. All right, guys, we're gonna hike down here a little bit, and then we're gonna turn on back. It was fun though. Got a crowded five. What was it? Six. Six brim. We're even. Yeah. So basically, I think what we're gonna do is first next one to catch the. How do I say this? The next one to catch the fish wins the Indian Creek fishing challenge. Let's go. We haven't got a bite in a while. Hiked down a little ways away from old James. Don't know where they're hiding, but we're on the prowl. Dang it, he just got one. Hold on to it. He just got one. He won the challenge. There it is, guys. Oh, I'm tripping. He caught the biggest one for the win. Old boy James. Pretty little fish. That's a pretty, pretty little sunfish. Oop. All right, James, throw back your uh, trophy fish. But uh, yeah, that was fun. Um, if you live out in uh, Alab northern Alabama, come to Indian Creek, catch some brim. But anyway, we're signing off. Until next time, I don't know. I don't know what to say. We'll see you.